彼の後継者を発見したことに対するビーラスの反応ビーラス doesn't want to be replaced in any way he fears the day that will happen We can see that his reaction to the idea of changing the god of destruction of Universe 7 was not at all good. First, when Yuzena played with the theme in his first appearance, both he and Kampa were not happy at all, and also at other times he asked if Goku and Vegeta aspire to the position. Not to mention the times that Whis compared him to Goku on the hard face, he hates to think he will one day be replaced. It seems he loves being a god of destruction. But also, who wouldn't, right? The stewardship that a destroyer has is gigantic. Beerus, for example, is in a comfort zone that I'm sure most of us wouldn't give up, right? But succession is inevitable. And whether Beerus likes it or not, it will come. That's why there are replacements for Hecations. In Universe 10, for example, we have Topo. And in Universe 7, who will that successor be? We have many names capable of taking this position, but few interested, most of them would undoubtedly refuse such responsibility, well, or at least what should be a responsibility. Because Beerus shows us the complete opposite, at least as a god of destruction he live in the good, don't you? When it was considered by Zeno that the god of destruction in Universe 7 had to be replaced, he got scared, and that was a joke. Now imagine how his reaction will be if this really happens, without being a prank. This story for you, so prepare a snack, something light so you don't get fat, settle down, get comfortable, and come with me. We all know that being a god of destruction must not be easy. You need to be aware at all times of the things that can be a delay in your universe, so that if necessary, destroy them. Said in the Tournament of Power that his dream is to be above Zeno Sama, and what brings him closer to that dream is to become a god, isn't it? So I have no doubt that Frieza would accept to succeed Beerus, and that would also give us an interesting arc. Imagine a saga where the god of destruction of Universe 7 rebels against all gods and wants to destroy Zeno Sama, it would be very epic. Apart from that, Frieza has the potential to be the most powerful character in the work, since his race is extremely resistant and powerful by nature. You remember that he trained only four months and has already reached the golden form, which was already able to face Goku and Vegeta, who trained for dozens of years to be where they are today. So, if Frieza trained with Beerus and became his successor, without a doubt he would easily surpass Goku and Vegeta and continue with his evil plans, only this time, accompanied by Whis, his angel, and Whis wouldn't stop him, as angels must remain neutral and serve their gods of destruction. So no doubt Whis would stand by Frieza's side if he decided to rebel and overthrow Zeno Sama, and this would be the return of the best villain in Dragon Ball history, the Emperor of the Universe, Frieza. But what about you? What do you think of all this? This video is ending. Don't forget to rate and comment if possible. A big hug to all. All the best always. See you later. Bye.